Hi guys, today will be slightly different from the past videos because I will be doing a demonstration on how to apply a HDB loan online. This is a common question which some of my customers have frequently asked me. So this is the reason why I decided to do this video and hopefully it could help you to guide you through in uh, applying your HDB loan online with an easy step-by-step -step method. So first of all, if you are at Google search, type in hdb.gov.sg and click on the link to HDB or you can go to www.hdb.gov.sg so it will bring the HDB main website and at the top row click on e-services after e-services you will see on the left hand column buying a new flat buying a resale flat and financing a flat purchase so select financing a flat purchase after you click on financing a flat purchase the first one application for HDB loan eligibility which are uh, called HLE and click on it then it will bring you the application page there are three options option one submit an HLE application option two is retrieve a draft HLE application which means you have already saved a draft of the application before and option three is apply for a HLE letter for new flat therefore for our case itself is buying a resale flat and we will select the option one submit an HLE application then we will come to login via your SIM pass so we proceed to login via your SIM pass key in your NRIC and password after that it prompt us to key in another 2FA password and usually we will select SMS OTP and the six digit one time password was sent to our mobile phone click submit after login we come to the application first page instruction and the HDB will ask to prepare all the applicants and occupiers income and supporting documents beside that there are some other instructions written here after reading it scroll down and click accept and we come to step two there are option of purchase of new flats purchasing a resale flat purchase of part share a joining flat and purchasing a resale flat under single Singapore citizen scheme the last two will be buying a new flat under single citizen and buying a DBSS so for our case itself is applying buying a resale flat as for the room type you can select accordingly to your preference then you scroll down you will see under applicant flat owner one your NRIC is filled so if you apply with your spouse you will fill in application applicant to your spouse NRIC then fill in any occupiers if you have a child or your spouse is a foreigner then scroll down and continue then answer the following question accordingly yes or no and continue declaration of property ownership yes or no continue then it goes to the next page will show you your personal particulars fill up those missing portion then you fill up your applicant to if your spouse is a SPR or citizen as the second owner then scroll down and click continue and we come to step 4 employment details then key in you and your spouse employment details employed with money CPF contribution job industry 
your occupation, your employer name, and your commencement date. Then key in the last three months income. For occupier, if any, key in their details accordingly. Either is unemployed or a full-time student for children. Scroll down and answer if you currently own an HDB flat and also fill in your correspondence address. Scroll down and click continue. So, it comes to step 5. Review your application. So, scroll down and check. Make sure all your applicants and if any occupier's details are accurate and correct. If all okay, scroll down and read the declaration and confirmation. Tick I we agreed to all of above and tick to authorize HDB. Then submit application. And we come to step 6, complete application. You will see a HLE number in bracket and you click on print the completed application form which later we need to submit together with your income and other supporting documents to HDB for them to process your HLE application via my dot at HDB or at www.hdb.gov.sg slash login my dots once you save the application form you can proceed to my dot at HDB so once you go into my dots you will see your HLE number and the due date for the submission of the documents and when you scroll down you will see what are the HDB required documents for the applicants or the occupiers and from here you, pre you can prepare all your documents ready and upload it accordingly and then scroll down check the box to confirm and submit success you will see your submission is successful page and done so you may view your application status in five working days via login to my HDB page and finally you can save as a PDF so this will come to the end of my video and I hope this video is helpful in guiding you how to apply your HDB loan step by step. So if you like this video, please give a thumbs up, share and subscribe to my channel. And I'm thankful that this could help in terms of my channel algorithm. And please comment below if you like to find out more on property issue. I will do my best to answer them in the next video. So I will see you in the next video. As always, stay safe and take care.